Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it! Hey, what's going on, everybody? How you doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. So here we are, another video from me to you, the wonderful people of the YouTube world. Hope you enjoy this. It's going to be amazing. Well, maybe not amazing, but it's going to be all right. Maybe. Hope you can hear me. I have not only the air unit on, the HVAC, the backpack, the knick-knack patty whack, whatever you want to call it, but I just purchased this pedestal fan today. It's hot. It's humid. And there's no air movement in the house. And I'm suffocating. I'm not even going to do a bike ride. I may not ride again until October. I'm not even kidding. I'm tired of it. But, having said that, let's get on to today's video, shall we? We're going to do a taste test, guys, and today's taste test is Fire Tortilla Chips from Taco Bell. Now, I don't expect these to really be fire. I eat their fire sauce by the packets and packets and gallons if I can get it. I love their fire sauce. I love Taco Bell. Matter of fact, I had Taco Bell last night. Good stuff. Nutritional facts. These are not for nutrition, so eat at your own risk. Yeah, that's probably what it says. We don't care about the nutritional facts. We're eating potato chips. Let's get the all-important sniff sniff. Mm. 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 Smells pretty good there, guys. Kind of hard to see, probably, but it's really a deep reddish orangish kind of color they're really kind of a uh, they're Instantly, that seasoning went like on the very back of my tongue. Like almost like you need a drink to wash it kind of off your tongue in the very, very, very back. Where it starts going down your throat. Almost like you got a dry throat. They're a thin chip. They're thinner than a Dorito. More along the lines of your typical tortilla, kind of a thin tortilla chip. There's a good aroma. Hmm. They seem to be really coated in that flavoring. Does it taste like the fire sauce? Maybe. Kind of let it sit here for a second and see what we're experiencing. Not a whole lot of anything. A little bit on my fingers there. Not much. Not, not even as much as a Dorito, probably. Definitely not as much as Cheetos. <laughs> The 
we'll kind of sit here and let let it kind of sit for a minute I mean they don't taste bad there's a lot of that uh, the spices and the, the seasoning on there You know, there's that typical, that typical spice or burn, hot, that you would normally get with your, your regular over-the-counter hot chips and stuff. I tend to not like to call these kind of things hot. I just kind of call them spicy. You know, hot, I'm thinking, you know, I'm going to be sweating a little bit and kind of, you know, having some issues. But Yeah, it's pretty good. It hangs around there for a little bit. It hangs around. Mm. That had a good bit, though. Stuff on it. Well, not bad. They're kind of a they don't chew like a Dorito. Not that they're supposed to be Doritos, I'm just kind of comparing them. I'm trying to get enough of the chips in my mouth to really coat. They're not the best, you know, hot style chip that I've ever had. But they're not the worst. They're a pretty good flavor. There's some heat that hangs around in the mouth. The chips have a appear to have a good coating of that seasoning on there, and they don't they don't come off too bad on the hands. That's not bad, guys. Not bad. I wouldn't turn them away. Well, there you go. My opinion, if you like these kind of foods, these have a little bit of different texture than some I've tried. But they are good. They taste pretty good. they got a good bit of the seasoning on there. Guys, I hope you appreciate the channel. I hope you like the videos. Go out and grab you some of these chips. Don't forget, get up, get out, get red, do it to it. Even with fire Taco Bell chip sauce seasoning on your hands. We'll see y'all later. Get up, get out, get ready, do it, do it!